This is Real Naughty. You're welcome to Real Naughty. Welcome to Real Nollywood. Alright wonderful people, it's great to have you on another interesting edition of Real Nollywood, your most entertaining movie program on television. My name is Colin Stoker and good to have you watching. Well, what do we do on Real Nollywood? We present the brightest and the best from the motion picture industry in Nigeria and sometimes the diaspora. And we bring them for you on our interesting segments such as True Nollywood Story, Knowledge is Just Justine, Making of Blockbuster Films, Current Events that's ongoing in the industry on Nolly Event, Nolly Carpet Retro and Moment. As you can see, Real Nollywood is a totality of what happens in the motion picture industry in Andre, and that's what we are all about. Well, today wouldn't be any different because we've got loads and loads of interesting things for you. Yes, I would want to say that Lancelot Odua Imanso's new movie titled Authentive Tentetic Marriage has premiered at the Silverbed Galleria here in Lagos and I was there to bring the sights and sound of the interesting comedy flick for you. Well, I want to say the Oyibo Princess was in town and the whole cast and crew of the film were available. So let's take a look at what happened on the red carpet at the premiere of ATM and I'll be right back. <music> everyone it's a great happening here at the motion picture industry in Nigeria at the Silverbed Galeria and we're here to welcome another film that is making an entrance a grand entrance into the motion picture industry in Nigeria and it's coming from Lancelot Odua in Maswe and this is called ATM Barista, uh, I marry a, a rich woman and we break up would they settle me with Plenty money. Mugbe. Robinson, this is money. I want to finish what I'm saying. I love your beautiful black dress. So what Thank are you. you. This dress is a beautiful dress and it was designed by Alfreda Eden. Oh, Alfreda um, Eden. Yeah, it's, it, it's a, one of her bespoke pieces, we could say. So, so yeah, I'm very grateful to be wearing You're this dress. We are. Yeah, we are. <laughs> I'm wearing one ensemble. One ensemble? Yes. Wow, this is beautiful and I but, love the outfit. Uh, my stylist put all of this together. His name is Fred. Where is Fred, my Fred, stylist? Where are you? All right. My stylist, he got the makeup, the hair, the nails, the dress. He put everything wow. together. So you guys need to see. So what, and what have you heard exactly? Um, good stuff. I uh, have few my, my friends on the movie. I have um, Alex Ekubo. I have um, Ivan Jagger there, you know, I have um, Francis Odega with this actors in the movie, uh, I mean, your guess as good as mine, you know, it's has to be the bomb, and I'm here to make it explode like the bomb. Well, I heard the ATM is going to be the most hilarious film right. of the year, yeah. Right. What else did you hear? Well, Alex Kubo is in it, fantastic actor, Ivan Jagger, my best friend is in it, uh -huh. Ivan Princess, who I'm looking forward to see, and then Francis Odega. Big ups. Oh, I heard it's, it's very hilarious. I haven't seen the trailer. People who have seen the trailer, yes. I have was, yeah. Wow. It was like, oh, Mr. Lambda, like, you have to be here, you know? This is something that would, you know, <laughs> crack your ribs and all that. And this season, trust me, you know that this season is not really a good season. So we need, we need, yeah, we need some comic relief, yeah. I heard it's really funny. I hear there's a white lady. I see her picture here. Um, I look forward to seeing her and her role. Oh, For me, that's my biggest intrigue. How she acted out the like, grand end of it and whether she did a good job. Yeah. Why you and my dear friend go deep inside room? You locked up. Let me tell you one like a true camp for your eyes. Ah, uh, Lancelot and Comedy. I've always known him that there is one comic parts in his um 
in his production. I've always seen his production. I felt I saw one of his movies very many years back. I can't remember the movie. And I knew that Lancelot doing comedy was not going to be a problem for him. So I... I this was long comedy. Yes, 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 yes. What do you have to say? Uh, well, for me, I heard about ATM and almost immediately heard it was Lancelot. And for some time now, I made it a duty that every week I must see a Nigerian film. Uh, because for me, I look forward to closing that rank technically between our production and the Western or the Hollywood production. And every time I go to cinema to see one, I see the rank getting closer and closer. And I'm here to come and see where we sealed it. That uh, yeah, technically sound, pictures, art direction, camera work, but we are there now. You just um, talked about it, say like, in nice, next thing, two, three days later, we are planning production, contacting actors, you know, putting things in place, and then, so three months down the line, he's on location for the movie. And are you happy with what you're saying? Oh, very well. I haven't seen the whole movie because um, I um, I wanted to uh, and space tonight to have okay. a nice time. You don't want to have yes. Yes. Like yes, I didn't want to come and then. <laughs> No, 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 no. I, I've just been seeing skits the way every other person has been seeing. So. Now, this snake we're called Bite Robinson. I ain't used to tell Flog you. Ah, don't die! On a plan, don't fail. Don't die, Ion! Uh, ATM for me was very challenging. Challenging in the sense that uh, we're working with a different crew, the cameraman, as that is director of photography. Uh, his own style of shooting was quite different from the style I'm used to. Uh, what are we talking about here? Yeah? His name is uh, St uh, Stanley. Stanley or Hikwari? Oh, Hikwari. Right, so, yeah, yeah. So his style was different from mine. He, he doesn't really like to light. He shoot his own with a kind of his lighting pattern. It's, it's different, different, from, different. Uh, from what I'm used to. So trying to pop out the color when I was creating the work was quite challenging for me. The most fun part of working on set is the fact that Lancelot is like a father to me. He's a friend to my father. So whenever I'm around him on set, it's like I'm around, I'm, I'm home. home. Yeah. yeah. So it's always fun working with him because he takes care of me like his own. Character Robinson is a character that wants to get rich quick. Who doesn't want to work for his money? Who wants to just make money by dating somebody he met online and taking her money and running away? Somehow it didn't work for him. This must be the next boss of his big, big thing. ATM. Get your ATM, go into any bank and then tell us your ATM. Wait him be your ATM experience. <laughs> Frick speed. Um, I just, I'd really like people to be able to, uh, there's two things. The first thing is to relate to the movie, understand the storyline in the sense that um, basically don't hurt other people. You know, don't do something to someone that you wouldn't want done to yourself. Treat everyone with respect. The second thing is to, um, Nigeria are very good at embracing people anyway. Um, this is more for a wider range and all you both people that we should try and learn and, you know, inject ourselves into a culture so that there's understanding rather than all this hostility. So, yeah. It's here. I mean, your ATM no grief for me to pepe again. Now your papa be ATM and go for me pepe. Thank you. Are you be the cause of all this problem? Would they make me the wrong come up from my own house? Oh, for a eye, you know, be open eye. Oh yeah, I mean, I've known um, my Uncle Brush to be a very um, serious-minded uh, director all over the years. I've been a fan of him. Okay. And to have him do a comedy-related movie, for me, it's, it's a big one. Oh, so okay. I came to see how that pans out, pretty much. Well, you know, Lancelot is a great guy, fantastic producer, great director. What else do you expect? Whatever comes from Lancelot turns to gold. ATM. I was told I'm going to leave here with an ATM card. So I'm waiting for my ATM card. All I will say, Lancelot, keep up the good job. You're making Nollywood proud. You're making Nigerian filmmakers proud. And we're happy you're part of this film industry called Nollywood. I mean, I, this is this is what we need. As 
long as we don't stop being creative, even in all of the problems and issues, I think the important thing is for us to continue to push. And someday, you know, we'll, we'll get to the promised land. And Lancelot is someone, you know, I respect so much uh, because, I mean, like I said, he, he's not, um, um, he's one of those who, pu who pushes boundary as well. And um, I will always be willing to support such a cause, uh, you know, I mean, for, for every reason. It's, it's amazing to see, you know, a Brit, uh, a fellow Brit here in, uh, you know, in, in Nigeria, uh, in Nollywood, which is one of the biggest industries in the world. And uh, it's nice to see that. And I'm hoping, you know, this is the start of something. Uh, and we see a lot more, uh, you know, collaborations and more kind of Brits coming here and, and being involved. All right. 419. If you they try to do anything smart for my eye, make you not try and I go use your yash, touch fire. Pull up. Get out of here, man. Okay, I'm Prince Paul. Uh, 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 yeah. Uh, did you see uh, Authentic Detective? Uh, yeah, it's an interesting movie. Something that you really need to watch. JP's a production. It's an amazing film. I absolutely love it. Alright, what was your high point? Um, the first thing when when um, Emilia spoke pigeon and Alex's um, reaction, you know, Robinson's reaction, which is Alex, it was to me it was a high point, and I enjoyed every bit of it. Aside it being entertaining, there was a lot to learn from, and it, there's a message out there for everybody. All you young boys that want to go out to the UK. <laughs> There's a, yes, there's a lot to do right here, and trust me, or you won't say if they don't get sick, so... <laughs> you, as a spectator, yes. how do you feel tonight? I, I felt very impressed, because I think what is um, interesting about um, when a filmmaker makes a film is the reaction of the people you are making the film for. If everyone will be as excited as they were from the beginning of a film to the end, then we, nobody left. Then we have at the film end that people are still looking we'll back. Like, <laughs> I please, has this film just finished? <laughs> it's amazing. And what I particularly like about sorry to call you about this is that the movie just starts on action. There's no moment where you're like, oh, okay, what's happening here? You know, there's a beginning, middle, and an end, and the movie was well resolved. You can't, can, yeah, it's like. Somebody just looks at the phone and what, 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 what did he say? You know, so it's one of those movies where it's a feel good movie, family movie, everybody can come and watch it, you know. It's, it's amazing, it's amazing. All right, up next on Real Nollywood is True Nollywood Story. And today on True Nollywood Story, I will bring to you one of the interesting cast of Alternative Tentative Marriage ATM, and that is. Onyibo Princess. <laughs> she's a full British born citizen and she speaks the broken English very well. And for her to have had this experience doing this very flick comedy, interesting comedy ATM, you would wonder. So how she has a lot to tell us on how she's been able to pull this off and how she had fun working with Lancelot. So let's listen to her on True Nollywood Story and I'll be right back. Actually, it's like, you know, I mean, I like all your combination, you know. My name, as you know, is Oibo Princess, but other people also know me as Claire, which is my born name, my birth name. But anyway, you don't need to know that one. Oibo Princess, Naliwe. <laughs> so where are you from? Okay, I'm from London. I actually live in London and um, studied in UK, always been there all my life. So that's where I'm from, UK. Okay, well, I've visited Nigeria before. In fact, quite a number of times I worked for an airline. So when I was working for the airline, obviously I traveled a lot and was blessed to come to Nigeria. In fact, all of Africa, but Nigeria I just had a passion for. So... Robinson, this is money! Ah! Ah! I just woke up with Mohammed and I bought a 
Okay, how long have I been doing movies? Well, actually, I made my very first movie when I was around nine years old, and this was back in the UK. It was a very short film. It lasted for 15 minutes, I think. So I've always been into entertainment, but you know, um, there's always a time to break free from local to try and push your brand a bit further so it's quite i feel i featured in quite a few films and and a lot of theatrical um you know like stage appearances because again i studied theater i went to the royal Brit british theater of dance and drama and i was a member there for what 25 years or so so um yeah it's been a long time um but this is my first nollywood movie so here we are. Oh, oh, okay. Why you and your friend go deep inside room? You locked up. You just say you want to make a joke hand for your eyes. Now you snake where can't bite Robinson. Now you use tail flog you. Originally, I, to be honest, um, I have a passion for culture and particularly Nigeria. So originally, I wanted to just be able to reach people that have touched my life in a certain way, enriched me. And there's a lot of qualities that I get from the Nigerian culture which I intend to use in my own life. So originally all I did was upload a Facebook page, made a Facebook page, um, and from there every day or every two days I would just greet people. There was just one at first, so I was just greeting one or two people, let me just say hi, and share one or two words in Pidgin that they can relate to. Um, and from there it, it grew. So Lancelot has people that have tagged me um, and tagged him in some of my videos and from there the rest is history. <laughs>